Welcome back to the channel everyone, it's Tom over at Gus. So today we've got this Ford Cougar in the workshop for a tow bar and it's having seven pin dedicated electrics. So this is the latest uh, shape Ford Cougar, I believe it's 2019 onwards. I'll get you set up on the stand and then we'll start removing the rear bumper. Some bolts. 
Chris has got parking centres as a plug just on the driver's rear, which we can get to underneath the vehicle. So we're looking at that. Now the whole bottom of the pump is all loose. And then we'll just pull it away from the top. And that will lift off. And we'll just pull it away. Can't see anything on there, so I think what we'll do is we'll just give the bump a pull. Hopefully that will just all pull off. So we've got the bumper off, so it just pushes into these plastic tabs. It's quite tight coming off. And I'll just remove the bit. Come in for now. And then we can just remove the four nuts and give it this rear support bar. So in our kit we've got two metal bars that just slide down the chassis and down like so. Then they will line up with holes in the chassis legs. So I'll just leave them loose for now and then we'll get the main Hold it into place. So now that's all in place, we get all these torqued up. Um, each tow bike will have, they'll have their own torque settings. So I'll go ahead and get all this tightened up. That's got two extra brackets there, which would slide in the middle if this was a hybrid. So the vehicle is probably slightly wider. But this one's not a hybrid, we won't need these. So I'll uh, get on, tighten all them up, and then we'll get the bumper back on and the electrics. So I've got the tow bar all torqued on, I've gone for a Oris tow bar, normally fit Brink or Witter or Westphalia but we're a bit limited for choice on this model and this is all the supplies had in stock for it, but nice and easy to use, get the key in, unlock it, pull it, twist it and then that's out and then to put it back in, nice and simple. 
Hey, okay, I will say with this tow bar, it didn't come with a bag or anything to keep that in when it's in the vehicle. So it's nice when they come with a little bag just to save that rattling around in the boot and keep it nice and neat. But it's not the end of the world. So what we we'll do is we'll get the bumper on now and then I'll show you the electrics. So I'm just holding the wiring. Got my plug on the tow bar and then there's a gummy in the boot where the wiring comes up through and then what I've done is I've mounted my control unit just in there behind the bracket I've tapped into the wire for the brake lights just there I'll tidy that up in a minute and then because the fuse box at the front and these, we've had to run a wiring loom all the way to the front, so that's the wiring loom there, and then I've run it all the way down. We moved all the side trims, followed it through to the front, and then you can just see there where it's coming back. So what I'll do is I'll go take the glove box out, feed all that in, and then um, I'll show you where it wires into. So I've got the wiring fed down the passenger side. So we picked up off the fuse box, so two fuses there, and then we've got our yellow and black, just going into the cam wires on the black plug there. And that is all wired in. So what I do now is I'll just connect the tester, make sure they all work, and then we'll wrap this one up. And that one is all done. Uh, the customer turned up for that one, so we didn't get a final walk around it, I'm afraid. But yeah, nice to fit. Um, it's always a shame when there's no fuse box or power points at the back, so a little bit more work involved running the cabling to the front of the vehicle, but. Apart from that nice easy install, uh, one thing I did have to do as well is code it, add parking sensors, so at least now when she puts it in reverse, um, it disables the parking sensors as well as some other little features, so that one is all done. Tow bar itself, uh, we use PF Jones in the UK, so if you're thinking about getting a tow bar fitted, uh, that is the best place to buy a tow bar from we find, but I hope you found this short video useful and we'll see you on the next one.